Maui bull hunter Troy Helmer took this video of deer running through a pasture in South Maui in November. He estimates he saw more than a thousand of them. And this photo was taken at Keopulani Park in Kahului back in October, around 6.30 a.m. on a Saturday. The overpopulated animals are also a major problem on Molokai. Deer everywhere. People were hitting them with their cars, their gardens and their farms were being destroyed. And so we're trying to find, you know, solutions, sustainable solutions on how to address this issue. House Bill 1872 requires the Department of Land and Natural Resources to recognize that game mammals provide a food source. And they're going in there and killing large amounts of pigs, deer um, and sheep. And the food goes to waste. Oftentimes, you know, they're doing it from a helicopter. The last thing we want to do is just shoot three or four hundred deer and let the carcasses rot. We, you know, to me, it's just. Personally, that's wasteful. Forces DLNR to look at hunting and game animals and game birds when making decisions. They have to look at how it would affect hunting and the meat and how they provide substance. Deer meat is a staple in our food source. And I can't understate, you know, overstate that enough. We, we have friends and family that eat deer meat uh, sometimes every day. And uh, part of that is the high cost of imported food. But if there are so many hunters throughout Maui County, why is there still a lot of deer? These hunters say access is a huge issue. There's no place legal to hunt right now. Helmer created these stickers that say, give us access. We have a lot of members and we're willing to go and help, but they gotta give us access. Hunters say HB 1872 is important because it includes them in conversations about managing Hawaii's deer population. Chelsea Davis, Hawaii News Now.